and then America voted for Trump. And there seems... <laughs> Okay, there seems to be an expectation everywhere that I should have written something about Americans voting for Trump. And I haven't written anything about uh, Trump because I'm trying to write a show that I'll keep on the road for 18 months. And as I didn't know how America voting for Trump was going to pan out, I didn't write anything about it. Okay, so I couldn't keep it in the show for the full length of the tour and monetize the work I've done. So I haven't written anything about America voting for Trump. So I don't see the point of committing to a course of action for which there's no logical or financial justification. <laughs> well, typically it's going better down here, isn't it? Down here. The elite of South End. They're going, how amusing Lee, they're going, how amusing Lee has used exactly the same syntax at the start of both the first and second halves with only two nouns changed in order to drive home the notion that both the Trump and Brexit victories are driven by the same populist rhetoric. How clever people up there are going, how embarrassing he's done the same bit twice. <laughs> we must be drunk. He's an alcoholic, I saw it on Twitter. <laughs> so... You know, cos I've got a Trump bit, I have to check at half-time every night that he's not been assassinated or fallen <laughs> into a barrel of porn actresses or something. And, uh... <laughs> but it does mean that I see the same crass anti-American generalisations online every night, social media, and, and it, it annoys me, to be honest, because... I don't know if you can make massive generalisations about <laughs> Americans that voted for Trump. <laughs> because Americans voted for Trump for all sorts of different reasons. <laughs> and it wasn't just racist that voted for Donald Trump. aren't they? Much worse than our British cunts, aren't they? Salt of the earth, British cunts. British cunts. British cunts. British Brexit voting cunts from South End. But... It's you, isn't it? But I don't know... Well, I don't know if you can make massive generalisations about... Americans that voted for Trump, seriously. I mean, not all Americans that voted for Trump wanted to see America immediately descend into being an unaccountable, single-party state exploiting people's worst prejudices to maintain power indefinitely. <laughs> Some Americans just wanted to be allowed to wear their Ku Klux Klan outfits to church, didn't they? <laughs> Perked up, haven't you, at half-time? Had a little chat, have you, with the people that brought you? <laughs> oh, do you think he's funny, John? Yes. Oh, I do as well, then. <laughs> oh, that was sick. 